my vocal folds vibrate, that creates the tone, and then the sound resonates through my throat, and then we articulate. So there are four processes involved in speaking. I can tell you, most of my clients that come in for voice work, they're wanting to move into a CEO position in their company, or they're speaking to the board of directors and they're not heard. Oftentimes, they're just not doing their job. You know, they're breathing over there, they're not even opening their mouth. They don't want to lie, but they just don't. You know, the tension maybe in, in, in our lives right now, start looking at where that tension holds you. Do you, do you tighten your jaw? Maybe use the breath, but if you don't open your mouth, you don't relax your jaw, the sound isn't going anymore, right? <laughs> so that, well, I was working with one gal, and she, all I said was, would you get a, let's get a mirror out and just watch your mouth when you speak. Then you might all do that too. After you've done your voice recording, go talk to yourself in the mirror. And someone's going to think you're crazy at work tomorrow, but that's right. You want to learn. So watch and talk to yourself in the mirror. You're on the cell phone, just watch yourself. Do you move your jaw at all? You don't want to be going like that to bars, right? But you do want to move it some. And you'll find that for vowels, you have to open your mouth. And if you don't, you're not going to be heard. I don't care how good a breath you have. If you don't relax that jaw, you're not going to be heard, right? So that's another little tip for you to think about. 